Hello everyone, I'm Riley Conover and this is the Tuesday morning edition of ISM Leading News, bringing you the latest information and updates from ISM 2016 in Indianapolis. ISM's strength comes from its boundless energy of its dedicated volunteers. One of the great ways to participate and enhance your own professional development is to join a group or forum that matches your area of interest. The benefits of the, the Women in Leadership group is to have women connect with women um, and really be a good part of a group that's going to help them to grow and network. I think that as women progress in the supply management field, it's really nice for them to have an outlay of how they can build their leadership skills and how they can interface with other women. It's nice to get involved in stuff because if you're involved in it, then you can make it and influence it and understand it and do things that uh, maybe will, will be beneficial to you, uh, maybe be beneficial to others, but it'll give you that sense of reward, it'll give you that you know, sense of um, belonging. And you know, that's, that's the reason most people volunteer is because they you know, believe in what they're doing, they want to help others, they want to make sure that they're providing uh, that assistance and, uh, and it's also a great way to network and, and meet people. Whether you're a subject matter expert or whether you're just starting out in your journey in this space, or whether you're looking to broaden your network, um, strengthen your skill base, um, ISM and the groups and forums memberships um, offer you an unparalleled opportunity to connect with thought leaders, um, engage at a higher level, and brand yourself um, in one of the fastest growing industries in business. On Monday, ISM recognized our great volunteer team at a special awards breakfast. At this year's conference, 95 volunteers have taken time away from their jobs and families to make this a can't-miss event. Nothing happens without the volunteers. With only 60 or 70 folks in Tempe, it'd be impossible for us to deliver the products and services that we do uh, domestically and internationally. So without a group of 1,000 volunteers, none of that happens. So really just helping our brothers and sisters in the profession get along, learn a little bit more, and, and perform a little bit better on the job helps us as an organization as well as the procurement profession. And now, a message from one of our conference sponsors. Hello. Nice to meet you. Nelda. I'm John. We invited you here today to get your honest opinion about this new car. To keep things unbiased, we removed all the badging and logos. So what do you think it is? I would say Lexus. Maybe Acura. It feels like a BMW. Let's look at the interior. <laughs> Reminds me of the inside of my friend's Lexus. So this car supports Apple CarPlay. Siri, open maps. Nice. Wow. She gets me. <laughs> Someone really took their time laying this out. Yeah. This car also has teen driver technology. It even mutes the radio until the seatbelts are buckled. Wow. My husband could use that. <laughs> I'm very curious what it is. What price range would you put this car in? 50 to 65. The $80,000 bracket. Well, what if I told you this is the 2016 Chevy Malibu? This is a Malibu? Yeah, let's go check it out. No way, it's oh, a wow. Chevy. And it sells for? It starts at 225. <gasps> what? Oh, wow. I'm very impressed. Yeah. I mean, all this technology. That's a game changer, really. I want one. I'll take the house, too. <laughs> For the first time at an ISM conference, the exhibit hall also became a car showroom. GM joined ISM 2016 with a beautiful fleet of Corvettes, Camaros, and Malibus. Also new to the floor this year is the first exhibitor from China. My company is focused on B2B platforms, and we are connecting the buyers and the suppliers around the world. So today here we have a booth and um, we would like to expand our markets through this uh, ISM events. And I would like to bring all these ideas back to China to tell our suppliers that how you should deal with uh, foreigners or Western company in here. And if you want to learn more about working with a Chinese OEM, Steve Cha is leading a session on the subject Wednesday morning. The ISM Corporate Program empowers your organization's success by including tools and resources for every supply management practitioner at every level, from essentials to executive leader. Visit instituteforsupplymanagement.org and enroll your organization today. ISM Corporate Program. Membership. Knowledge. Insights. Thomas Net and ISM have identified 30 rising stars in the profession under the age of 30. Here are two more rising stars you should get to know. It's a very elite group of, of people that we um, got recognized together with and 
um, again, just having that networking experience too, to be able to say that you're in this elite group is fantastic. I think for me, ISM just keeps you sharp. So it gives you a lot of opportunities to learn new things, a lot of opportunities every month, just even with just the dinners going and seeing different speakers and meeting with your colleagues, I think it holds you accountable to make sure you have that continuous education um, and that ability to grow. And to me, that's very important. It's just a, it's a good reminder that you need to be doing development and it keeps you on your toes. Thank you for watching this edition of ISM Leading News. I'm Riley Conover. Join us later today for another conference update.